Yes, thank you for clicking on my channel and welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. Here's some energies being thrown for your way for the week ahead. And Aquarius, I can't tell you how important it is for you to um, hit that notification bell or make sure it's hit for the video coming out on the full moon or for the full moon, the energies. This is probably the most important video I have ever done for the zodiacs, the collective, as to what's happening this full moon in Scorpio on the 27th. Extremely and hugely important, earth changing, global changing, humanity changing, universe changing. So please do subscribe if you haven't and hit the notification bell as well. I'd be Pulling some free cards for people in the chat tomorrow night at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Well, Aquarius, we have someone returning from the past. Someone who finds you highly desirable. Someone that you've been waiting for. Or maybe they felt like they waited a long time for you. There's some uh, wisdom here emotional energies love you're gonna to have to make a decision and it may be between two people and it's got you in a dilemma it could be the decision is like heart over logic or maybe the decision is between heart and or work and home um we have this confident you But this decision, you're giving the outward appearance of that confidence. But inside you're like, it's a dilemma. It's a dilemma. We have someone very wise that does care a great deal for you. At the head of your reading here, we've got this reality that you're creating is beginning to grow. That seed is growing. this new reality but this person from the past what's going on there clarify this for Aquarius please a love that is growing Gemini energy we see Scorpio as well as Aries if that means anything to you this is about divine timing A new reality that is growing. This new beginning. This could be about money. You've been waiting for a business to pick up. This is also the miracle card. At the crossroads. This person from the past. It's a dilemma. There's something selfless that you do. That pays off. You have manifested this. Could be a Scorpio. Could be a Virgo. It could be that you've manifested this person at this time was needed in your life to bring you this wisdom. Emotional fulfillment. You are going to make a decision for your emotional fulfillment and follow your destiny. This does feel like this is not a very easy decision that you are making though. But the decision you make encompasses that fulfillment within the home. Wanting to follow that, follow that destined path that you're on, but you want that love. Could be, this is the need for clearing those energies. Um, so much want, you're blind to it coming in. Let's ask for advice in love for Aquarius. So we get a message of love for Aquarius. Hmm. 
Not that many, but not more than one. You deserve love. You are lovable. Past life, a relationship, you've known each other before. Could be Aquarius. And I do strongly feel like it's been a, a matter of dealing with a lot of old life stuff. Again, it's important with the zodiacs because Aquarius, I have to look it up again. What's going on with Aquarius? It, 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 I believe it's this battle with Saturn that the old paradigm just Aquarius is, we're in the age of Aquarius now, and this is about knowledge and having to shake off the old world. And on that full moon, it's a big one, Aquarius. It's like that final shaking of the paradigm. Welcome to the new world, the new reality. And it's it may be a little scary. But this past life stuff is being dealt with. Give this relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Perhaps be more open in allowing love in. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. When you meditate, open that heart chakra. It'll do the vibe thing to bring it in. <laughs> I hope that helped. God bless you, Aquarius. And we'll talk to you again soon, I hope. Bye-bye for now.